Eagles Farm and this Lotto NRFL Women's Premier clash between Eastern Suburbs and Onihunga Sports. Let's look at the lineups. Eastern Suburbs, a number of notable players, actually have National Women's League experience. Karina Brown, Erna Wong, Leah Metzum, Rebecca Van Dort, Lucy Carter, just to mention a few names. Jade Paris, Golden Boot, scorer last year. Finished the league winning the Golden Boot in the NRFL Women's Premier. Kate Sita actually played for AFF and NFF in the National Women's League. Heading across to Onihunga Sports, Katie Duncan. Football fern, been to the World Cup, has done it all. We're off. Referee Beth Wattray gets us underway. Here's Megan Robertson. Starts to go back to Karina Brown. And the skipper Rebecca Van Dort. Cleared away here by Wong. Corner in, just not dealt with here by Sports. Here's Liam Metam on the corner again. It's a header on towards goal and it's gone in. Rebecca Van Dort has put Eastern Suburbs in front in the 13th minute. Great header. Great delivery from Liam Metam. Eastern Suburbs 1, Onihunga Sports 0. And Colleen Wynn Stanley, I think it was, just came sliding in for the shot. Straight at Karina Brown, though. Brown coming out to punch it away. And here's young Ava Collins. Darting forward. Finds Hannah Hoxima. And here's Taylor O'Brien, who makes it 2-0. Suburbs in front. What a great goal that is. Eastern Suburbs 2, Onihunga Sports 0. Duncan, a lot of experience, professional career as well in Europe. Stevenson squares it across to Canty who just can't put it in the net. And Karina Brown just walking it back. It's actually quite good with her feet. Just messing around here with Sophie Stevenson. Cleared away here entirely, and Lucy Carter goes on and goal, and it's just come off the head of Ava Collins. And referee Beth Rattray calls half time here down at Maddles Farm. Eastern Suburbs lead by two goals to nil. Goals from Rebecca, Rebecca Van Dort and Taylor O'Brien. And sports get us underway here for the start of the second half. And Stevenson on the ball. Possessed. And here's Kate Seater. Decides to go from long range. Oh, Stevenson can't get the ball on target. Here's Erin Wong. Decides to have a shot. And it's just gone wide. Delivery here by Metam. Punched away here by Briar Guyon. And it's ping pong in the box here. Oh, and Caitlin McKay can't exactly, couldn't hit that right. Stevenson. The ball's just launched forward. Oh, and Karina Brown having to pull off a magnificent save here. Only how sports would have been back in the match. Stevenson on the header. Annie Byrne releases Taylor O'Brien, who gets a bit of Win Stanley. Squares it across to Lucy Carter, 3-0 to Eastern Suburbs. Great build up here by Eastern Suburbs. Eastern Suburbs 3, Onihunga Sports 0. Paris with a little flick on through to Liam Metham. It's crossed into the box and it falls for Annie Byrne. Oh, and it's off the crossbar. O'Brien tries to square it across. Briar Guy and makes a save. And Ava Collins trying to wriggle the way through, and O'Brien tries to dink it over. Oh, and Annie Byrne gets a better here of Kirsten Oldfield. And Guyan couldn't make the save. Jay Paris pinches it from her hands and makes it 4 0 to Eastern Suburbs. Jade Paris, currently the top goal scorer of the lead, now on 18 goals. It's not dealt with here by Suburbs, and Duncan puts it in. And Onihunga Sports have a goal back. Eastern Suburbs 4, Onihunga Sports 1. 
Jay Paris standing over the free kick. Decides to shoot. It's just come off the wall. And Briar Guyon can't catch it here. Eventually, a free kick to sports. Here's Duncan. Releases Annabelle Paquito. And it falls to Stevenson. Oh, and what a great save by Karina Brown. And here's Oldfield. Can sports get another goal here? And O'Brien wins the tussle with McKay. And Annie Burnson gets the better of Oldfield and she just dinks it over the keeper. What a goal that is. Eastern Suburbs 5, Onihunga Sports 1. And McKay on the free kick. Decides to go long and that's it. Referee Beth Rattray calls full time here down at Medill's Farm. Well, we had two... Magnificent goals in the first half. Rebecca Van Dort and Taylor O'Brien started off for Eastern Suburbs. And then Lucy Carter and Jade Paris added it added to it to make it 4-0. Katie Duncan pulled one back in the 80th minute, but Annie Byrne in the 91st minute rounded off the day for Eastern Suburbs. Final score, Eastern Suburbs 5, Onihunga Sports 1. good result for us and we're looking very very strong especially in the second half we improved a lot we improved a lot with the ball with the key position and we control complete com, com, we complete control the game in the second half so so proud with the girls they made a great job especially in the second half firstly I don't think that we deserve to be beat by that much today I thought the girls um, fought hard throughout the whole game and um, look suburbs are a really good uh, organized uh, team and particularly going forward and um, they exposed us in certain areas where we were, we were a little bit weak and uh, they put away the chances and they counter-attacked really well, so full credit to them.